welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be a weekly vlog. I don't think I've ever done a weekly vlog before, but I've been really enjoying watching them, so I thought I'd give myself a go. I'm a bit worried that I'm out of breath already. I haven't even been on my dog yet, but I am about to go already on my dog. Mind the um, recycling bin down there, really glamorous. I'm back on my jogging train these days, and I'm really enjoying it. I'm not good at it. <laughs> Like, I'm not good at jogging at all, but I really enjoy it. And I thought I would, I need to go to the shops to get some, a small amount of food bits. Like, we've got most of our stuff, but I just need to top up on our food shop. Um, and I thought I would jog there instead of driving my moped. So, that's why I've got my little backpack on. I'm going to jog into where the shops are, um, pick up a few bits, and then I also want to pick up some little pots because a while ago on TikTok, I saw this trend, or this video, not a trend, of somebody planting dragon fruit seeds. So my mum bought a dragon fruit and saved me some of the seeds because I couldn't find dragon fruit um, near me at the moment. And so I've got all of those dried seeds there. So I'm gonna try and plant them all and see if I can grow a cactus out of it. So I need to get some little pots to put some seeds in. Um, and it's looking like a nice day. It has been raining, but the sky's looking a little bit more blue now. So I've got no excuse, I better get going. Hello, so far so good. Doing really well with this weekly vlogging thing because it's now Wednesday. I just completely didn't film yesterday at all um because i got really ill like i just felt so rough yesterday i don't know what was going on i woke up with like a banging headache i haven't been sleeping well the past couple of nights which i'll talk about actually a little bit when i get back um i'm actually going to go and get a covid test <laughs> right now because i had a cough yesterday i mean i'm feeling much better today i feel fine i'm actually going to jog there just to get my exercise in very gentle jog though because i am feeling really tight tight chested still but i do want to just double make sure that i don't have it before i go spreading it to anyone um but yeah i have quite a few bits to get doing once i get back and also i talked to you about my sleep because i've been really struggling recently with these crazy crazy dreams but for now, I've got this test in like 20 minutes. It's like a 15 minute walk, but I'm gonna jog very slowly on and off. So I should start leaving. Well, I should, I should leave now, really. So I'll let you know how it goes and I'll catch you up when I get back. Back from my jog and COVID test. Feeling definitely like a hell of a lot better than I was yesterday. So I really don't think it's COVID. It's just the fact that I've got this cough. But now I'm thinking, I don't know whether the cough is because I've been jogging again and irritating my chest because I have really old exercise induced asthma that I don't take any medication for, but it is there. And that's my main symptom now and just a bit of a headache. So I did pick up some Lemsip and other bits. Um, so I'm hoping I can just knock this cold on the head. Um, but... I've got quite a few bits to do. I've got some cleaning up to do, but I did just want to mention, I think also why I'm feeling so exhausted is because I haven't been able to sleep properly. There's multiple reasons for this. It's because the flat that I'm in is quite loud. We live just above a like gardening shop and they're so loud in the morning, like, really loud just like talking but you know when people like shout at each other instead of talking and like really loud laughing and i'd never thought i'd be the th sort of person that would get so angry <laughs> at the sound of somebody laughing but when it's waking you up at like seven o'clock every morning bearing in mind i'm just not a morning person anyway i think just because of the industry that i'm in it's generally more like late nights sleep in the morning sort of thing so and also i just think my my personal productivity and stuff i get so much more productive later on in the day like right now it's one o'clock or like half one and i'm just starting my day and this is how it is every day this is when i just start my day and then i don't go to bed until like one um probably not the best but it works for me but it doesn't work when i'm being woken up 
every day. So I think that's one reason. Another reason is, I don't know if any anybody else feels this way, but my dreams, my dreams have always been mental. Like, so bizarre. I never dream anything like mundane. It's always so twisted and weird. I always wake up from my dreams just being like, huh? But like, it's so weird. I never wake up from my dreams thinking, oh, I just had a really nice dream that I won the lottery. Like, no. Um, but recently, over the past like week, my dreams have been like next level madness. And I've literally felt like I've been having such active mental, like mentally exhausting dreams that I, I keep waking up being more tired than what I went to bed. Because I feel like I've been living like a whole year in my dream world and then I'm waking up. I don't feel like my brain's had any rest and I think this is because I'm probably not sleeping that deeply because I know, I think dream sleep, like REM sleep, is a lighter state of sleep. Like when you're in really deep sleep, you don't dream. Um, so I think I've been just like having really light sleep all night and dreaming mental things and I'm waking up just being like, A, really confused and concerned for myself over the sorts of dreams that I'm having and B, just so tired. And I think maybe that's impacted how I'm feeling now. Um, does anyone else like that? Does anyone else just have the most, like, and I'll, I'll, talk, like, I'll tell my friends or Johan about the sorts of dreams that I'm having and he'll be like, I can't even explain it now because once they're gone, they're gone. But if I tell somebody as soon as I wake up, so Johan, he will be like, that's a really weird dream. And I'm like, that's just, I've just explained like the, the tip of the iceberg of the dream to you. And even you think it's weird, so. Does anyone else like that? Does anyone else just have like the most mental dreams and wake up, like especially recently, I don't know if it's because of lockdown, just been waking up feeling like exhausted because of it. But anyway, I'm going to tidy this kitchen because it's a mess. Um, and then I've got to, I mean, basically just tidy the whole flat today because it's just, I when you move out, into your own place, you realise how much you need to tidy. It's like every day. Great. and tidy now ish uh do you know i just got really carried away with tidying and i ended up realizing how disgusting all of our cupboards were just as, like shit on the front of them and i had never even looked down there before so i ended up just cleaning all of the like front of the cupboards and it looks much nicer now just put my coffee oh actually my milk in the microwave this is my coffee right now. Hardly any coffee at all. So this is going to be mostly a warm, frothy milk drink, which I'm not mad at. Mm. Oh yeah. I would never have usually drunk mostly a milk drink with cow's milk because I have never liked cow's milk. Um, but obviously since being vegan, I've been trying out other sorts of milks and oat milk is just incredible. I could drink oat milk just straight from the glass. Also, I have to say, don't look at my nails. How embarrassing. Uh, I am going to take this one off later um, and just redo them. They look disgusting! Oh, don't judge. Time for my weekly batch of bread making. Um, this has been rising for the last like three hours, so it's definitely ready to go in the oven now. So from this, I go into onto this baking tray that's got some oil on it. 
into the oven for 20 minutes and then we end up with to this look at that looks amazing i'm gonna have a little bit with some olive oil and balsamic vinegar anyway i think for the rest of the night i'm just gonna chill uh have a bath i've got one running now and i'll probably speak to you tomorrow morning it's now thursday it's like two o'clock had a very very relaxed morning johan's off work uh he's working from home but just sat down on the playstation play a few games got up kind of late i've been sleeping much better um i had some cbd oil last night and that really helped i'm probably going to be looking like this all day so i hope you don't mind me just like in my pajamas don't have any particular plans for the day what i have just done actually is try to make some cashew yogurt um which is currently in the oven <laughs> not being cooked but it's just in the oven because the oven's warm i've kept the light on in the oven i don't know if you can see this is what it's looking like <gasps> Oh God, don't want to spill it. I just put some cling film on the top and put it in a glass bowl and I put two probiotic pills um, in with cashews and water and blended it all together. And <laughs> apparently that is how you make homemade cashew yogurt. So I'm intrigued. Uh, I'm gonna leave it in there for like, they say at least six hours, but I think I'll just leave it in for like a day or like until tomorrow morning and see if I can make really simple homemade cashew yogurt because that would be amazing. Um, I've got to take some pictures of some bedding that I'm putting up on my Etsy. I will show you when I do that. Um, start editing this video. I think that's what I'm going to do today. And also last, last night I started making some um, coasters, some new coasters because I've got to send a few coasters out. If you don't know, I have a little Etsy shop. I'll link it down below. Um, I sell tie dye stuff, and then I've just started selling some like resin coasters on there as well. Um, so I'll show you those in a little bit. But Johan's working in there right now, so I won't go in there right now. Um, but I made like five coasters, four to send away, and one to put up on my Etsy. So I had a productive day yesterday. Today's going to be a bit more chilled. Um, I did get my results from my COVID test back. I am negative. Yay. I, I, I mean, I'm not surprised because I feel fine now, but just thought it was better safe than sorry. Um, and yeah, I will keep you posted on how everything's going. My dragon fruit seeds don't look like they've done particularly much right now, so I don't need to show you those yet. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go and tidy up in my bedroom a little bit and then take some pictures for my Etsy. I don't know about for you guys, but my bedroom, or well, mine and Johan's, is just full of crap all the time. But anyway, this is our bedding, um, and I'm going to change it into the one that I'm going to put on Etsy, and I'll show you how that is. And this is the new bedding, which I so prefer. <laughs> I mean, there is like two years difference with me doing the bedding between my old one down there and this new one, so I feel like I've got a lot better at it, but... Oh, I think it looks really good. So I'm gonna take some photos of this now. Probably make a TikTok of it as well and get it uploaded to my Etsy because it's been waiting to be uploaded for like a week, two weeks maybe, and I've just been putting it off. So that's my task right now. Happy Friday. It is a beautiful day out today. I mean, it's not even the morning. I've just woke up and I think it's probably like 12 or something. Um, yeah, I really need to sort my sleep schedule out. I've been away for a while, I just couldn't get out of bed. Anyway, I've got my breakfast here. And... A coffee this morning. Um, and I'm gonna try this um, cashew yoghurt that I made yesterday. This is how it's looking. I would have preferred for it to be a bit thicker, which I mean, I think I just like should have had added less water. Um, but I have had a little taste and it tastes amazing. So let's see how it is with my muesli. So I've just got muesli, cashew yogurt, blueberries, raspberries. I've got a little bit of agave nectar on there and some seeds. Mmm. 
that's really good really good wow um i wish it was colder because i left it out all night um i can imagine when it's fresh out of the fridge it's going to be even better it's so creamy i'll get just some of yogurt by itself like it's so thick and creamy and so easy to make so if you have a blender and some cashews and some probiotic capsules give it a go wow impressed so my plans for the day in a minute i'll show you the coasters that i've been making i need to make another four coasters ready to send off I need to return a package, uh, one of my moped jackets that I'm not keeping, and what else do I need to do? Do my nails, because, like I said, my nails are disgusting. And then, I think I'm very, very tempted, I might go out to work for a little bit tonight. Um, I work for delivery sometimes, do some delivery driving, because I already have a moped, and it's just a really easy way to get quick money when I need it. Um, so I might go out for a few hours because we want to get a takeaway tonight and I feel like I need to earn some money. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's me just going into one of my daydreaming phases. That was really weird, sorry. Um... <laughs> I'm gonna eat my breakfast, have my coffee, and then um, show you my coasters. Had an hour or two of gaming time, and I just thought I would show you my new coasters. Actually, I'll turn you around, because that'll be easier. So, these are the new ones that we've made. Um, all of this sort of color, you can kind of see it differently in different light. I put like orangey bronze and black in these ones and these were a custom order to be sent off um, and a bit of rose gold leaf in there as well and then this I think I'm going to put up on my Etsy it's a silvery greyy white sort of tone um, I really like how it's turned out actually and I'm going about, about to make some more. I think I need to do purple and blue. Um, so I'm going to do those now. Can't believe the time. It's already four o'clock. This day's just flown by, I think, because I got up so late. But I'm going to show you what I've been up to. I've been making some more resin coasters. Which currently look like this. I wanted them to be a little bit more purple, but the blue's kind of taken over a little bit. But anyway, I think I look cute still. I also just, I'm going to put this on top to stop dust getting in there. Made myself some lunch, some Pedro and Peppers, avocado on toast, vegan cheese and ham on toast, and some vegan bacon, and another little cheeky coffee. And that is where I think I'm going to end this vlog, this weekly vlog. It's been like a Monday to Friday vlog. Let me know if you've enjoyed it. Please let me know if you anyone has watched it to the end or if this was just really boring. Uh, I appreciate all the feedback. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. I really appreciate it. And leave me a comment down below. Let me know what your plans are this weekend. It's looking like a really nice day today. So I am going to go out to work. <laughs> and I'm really, really hoping that the weather stays this nice for the weekend. But it's England, so who knows. Anyway, I hope you have a lovely weekend. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.